supporting arts and culture in the city of Toronto doesn't just mean supporting it downtown, too. There's a lot of <laughs> <laughs> uh, Now, is, is Paula Fletcher here? I, I don't know if I can. Okay, no, so we're, last but not least is our own Cindy Rosenbluth. Stephen Casey, and last but certainly not least, 
um, the lovely and talented Real and Barbara Aguchi, who, uh, <laughs> our landscape artist who uh, really took a lot and spent literally thousands of hours, I'm sure, getting to know the community and researching our history, uh, talking to people and taking all that and putting it into those ultra big choroplast silhouettes that you see on the uh, on the Danforth. And they all have his, they all have meaning. So if you if they don't, um, maybe if you don't recognize the meaning immediately, it's worth it's worth checking it out because it's a lot of fun to it. Um, Yes, okay. So I also like to thank the volunteers, of course, and, and the volunteers did so much and span from, from little to big, from the people from the people who wrote letters um, to help support our grant application, to um, um, the people who helped call the realtors in the stores uh, that were empty, um, people who helped install all those pieces that you're seeing, and all the people that we hope to coerce to come back and disinstall them. <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah, and all the people came to the workshops and shared their ideas and their passions with us, which was fantastic. Um, as I said, I can't, I can't name everybody, it would take too long. I'm just going to end with a, a broad thank you. Um, and I did want to say, well, I asked you, I asked you guys to take an enormous leap of faith with me. And I truly am proud and honored that you were willing to go there. I hope that you're proud of yourself because I sure am. <laughs> <laughs>